know 30 Miles Out gear is here. Check it out at 30milesout.com. You're watching 30 Miles Out Kayak Fishing TV. So come along on the next kayak fishing adventure, leaving now. With your host, Ty Sutherland. Tyatrice's kayaks provided by Mariner Sales, Wind and Paddle Sports. 30 miles out is brought to you part by Line Cutters, changing the way you cut fishing line. Yak Attack, rigging the dream. Right on Trailer Company. Rattle Trap, Smith Optics. The Backwater Paddle Company, the Assault Hand Paddle Revolution is on. The Fish Grip, get your best grip. And by book one. Follow me. Use code word 30 miles out and get 10% off at kayakfishinggear.com. That's hook one. Because they're that way. I mean, follow me this way. Yes, for sure. All right. We just left Tallahassee. And we are headed to Fort Pickens, Pensacola. Right? Yes. Teresa? Right. Mm -hmm. Correct. We just left the KOA King. Alright, don't worry about it. We'll be at Fort Pickens soon and we'll be fishing before y'all know it, so just hang on. So we started in Pensacola. We fished down to Tampa, down to Miami, down to the Keys. We've worked our way back up, and now we're going to end at Pensacola. Our specific destination is Fort Pickens State Park, which is right at the end of the island and right at a pass. Some awesome camping and some great fishing. We are Fort Pickens State Park. Headed to Fort Pickens. We're almost to the end. Yeah, man. Beautiful sand. White, white powder white sand. Get up in there, give me a camp spot. We have Fort Pickens trees are supposed to be getting us a camp spot. Get us a good one. Teresa's in there signing us up. Got the yaks on my right on trailer. Ready to hit the water. Got a little bit of breeze cooking right now. You can see a chop out in the gulf. About a 10 mile an hour, 12 mile an hour wind. Making it a little bit choppy. Yep. Oh well, we're gonna make it happen. Good thing about four pickings is if you put in on that side, if it's calm on the gulf side, and if it ain't, then you come over here and you put it on the bay side. And we've caught red snapper, kings, uh, cobia tarpon, all that's in there on the bay side. So we're set. Let's get to fishing. I'm tired. You watch the 30 miles out. Holy mackerel. All right, so here we are at Fort Pickens getting all set up. Teresa's over there messing with the tit, and I'm messing with the kayaks. So we're getting all rigged up to fish for a couple days. We're ready to sleep. This is a beautiful state park. There's lots to see here. The fishing is amazing. You have the bay side, you have the pass itself, and you have the gulf side. All right, let's get rigged up and get ready, and let's rock. Love fishing in Florida. It's fun. This was the end of our trip, and we were both exhausted from all the paddling. Tired. All right, Pensacola Bay. We're going to put in. See what we can't find running around out here. It's the end of our trip, and we're beat. We're going to keep on going. Just for you. Hope you appreciate it. All right, we're on some thread fin herring. Teresa Sabiki jigging them up. You got one already. Get us another one, girl. Get us another one. Lots of bait action, y'all. There they are. Red pin herring. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's amazing. Come on, throwing some beakies, trying to get them. Awesome bait. It's 8 a.m., folks. And in the background, you can hear the Naval Air Station in Pensacola playing. Star Spangled Banner. The ball's bursting. Eight o'clock, straight up, man. It's just time to wake up and fish. Teresa's singing it. Sing it. <laughs> That's the USA. I got something big, folks. I got something big. I don't know what it is. But it's good size. Ah! So I'm fighting a big fish between my legs and I got a hook stuck in my arm. Uh, I'm not fucking mine. I got a hook in my arm. Okay, get it out. He's peeling a lot, man. I'm... And there's no telling what this is. I got a thrift in here and I got a double stinger rig and I got steel. 42 pounds steel eater. Woo! Wow, oh, guys, I have no idea. Thrift fin herring was about 10 inches long, longer than that. It took a pretty big fish to grab that. And this sucker is straight down. No idea what I got here. Oh, it's a big shark. Yeah, it's, it's a good size shark. Yeah, there he is. Not really targeting shark, but they are a fun species to catch. They are fast. Man, he took my whole fish. Let's go. Yeah, gum it. Got my leader. Everything. Everything. <laughs> okay, so he ain't done yet. <laughs> I need to wear him down. Come on, man, again? Deep green. <laughs> I ended up cutting that guy loose. Let me show you what I use for bait. Y'all wanna see what I caught that shark on? This is our bait right here, threadfin herring. Look at the size of him. That's what I'm talking about. That's exactly what I caught him on. Look how big. What? Caught him on sabikis? Is that a beautiful bait or is that a beautiful bait? Sabiki jigging, Pensacola Bay, live and well. Let's get back out there and see what else we can catch here in Pensacola. Teresa is beaking me up a hardtail jack here. So I made some of these in the car. Stinger rig, steel leader, 20 pound mono. Control this behind the boat till we get out to that buoy. Drop it down, see what happens. That's what I'm talking about. Got some more big threat fins and there's something blowing up on them. Awesome! I think there's jacks on them or something. Should have threw my sabiki. 
Take your time. Untangle your spinky rig. Let's see what happens with Ty and Teresa and all this bait blowing up. We'll be right back. A pot of dolphins around me. I don't want them on this, this buoy because, uh, well, they eat everything. <laughs> you took your bait? Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Coming back for more. Still after it? There he goes. There he goes. Nope. Yep, you're hooked up. Is it big? Do I need to let you go or no? You let it go? Oh man, took your jack. That's what I caught this guy. <laughs> Chunk of cut something. Ooh, this is a bigger fish. Yeah. Holy shnikes. Uh-oh. Man. Coming. Yeah, shark fishing in the USA. Yep. On a 4,000 reel, 30 pound braid. Whoa, who was that? I have no idea. I think it was a. A king or a tarpon, I mean Atlantic uh, sharp nose. 30 pound mono. Circle hook allowed if you catch it right in the corner of the mouth. And they go get my hook. Yep, he gone. <laughs> get you some of that. That's what's up. Pensacola, Florida, man. Pensacola Bay. Never know what's going to hit. Like fishing offshore inshore. Bam, that's what's up. Uh oh. Oh, Teresa. I did. Going right to that damn buoy. Back paddle, something. Back paddle, I don't know how. He's going out to see it. Can't. What the hell is that? I don't know. What'd you have for bait? Uh, yeah, be a shark. Girl. There you go. The sharks must be just stacked up thick around that buoy. What I'm talking about. You got something big. Tracy's using a seven foot all pro rod and a 4,000 size reel with 30 pound power pro. Uh, heavy bass tackle pretty much. Can I just let him go? Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's gonna be gift up. Teresa ended up fighting him a little while longer, and then we let him go. These sharks are a blast, y'all. Tracy's back in the thick bait again. Oh man. So we keep coming into these schools, catching bait, and then going back out to the buoy to fish. Is that Jackson there? Whoa! This is crazy, y'all. Feeding frenzy! There's a lot of big fish in there. The ladyfish were feeding on tiny minnows, and there was something bigger feeding on the ladyfish. What is that?
that skipjack? He will not hit my plug. Skips, huh? Chasing menace. Oh my god, something just boiled huge. Man, you never know what you're going to see out here, folks. Teresa was in the middle of it. Oh my god. How cool was that? Bad of the boat. I got his butt that time. This, this. Ooh. A little big. The skipjack flipping around has got the that. attention of somebody. Nice skip. Oh, wait, wait. The dolphin's after my skip. You can't have him, Mr. Dolphin. Get away. The dolphin's trying to eat my skipjack. Yeah, those big boils of air. That's dolphins down below trying to take my skipjack off of my hook. Right, get away, little rascal. The reason we keep chasing minutes, down man. all these skipjacks is because they make awesome bait. You just gotta throw it man. You just have to. Amazing. They are so enthralled with those minutes. I want to hit my plug. I can get one to whack my plug every now and then, but they are so in tune with those little bitty minutes. These dolphins are traveling along with us. They're, they're eating the same stuff that we're trying to catch. The thread fin and the skipjack. I think they're more focused on the skipjack. Okay. They really don't care that we're here. They're just fishing right alongside of us. Smart animal, man, and they like people. It's like really heavy rain. We ended up catching a few of these ladyfish, but mainly it was just amazing to be in the middle of all that. Whoa! And one take a swipe. Well, as much fun as that was, I guess it's time to head on back in. Camping and fishing Florida from top to bottom has been awesome. The Florida series was so much fun to put together. We hope y'all have had a great time watching it, and I'm sure we're going to do it again. If you'd like some information on where we stayed and how we camped and how we kayak fished, just head on over to 30 Miles Out Facebook and hit me up with some questions. I'd like to take a quick moment and talk about our sponsors. They really help make 30 Miles Out possible. Mariner Sales. If you're in the Dallas area, the North Texas area, and you need an awesome kayak fishing shop with tons of kayaks, check them out right in the middle of Dallas. Mariner Sales, Wind and Paddle Sports. Line Cutters. Vance has come up with the coolest way to cut fishing line I've ever seen. It's handy and it's on your hands. Backwater Paddle Company. It puts a troll motor on your kayak. Y'all see me use them, I love them. Ride on Trailers. We used our Ride on Trailer all throughout the Florida episode from Rockport to Key West and back. Rattle Trap Floating Trap. Check it out. Smith Optics. These things are light and we love them on our face. Yak Attack. You've seen us use the panfish. You've seen us use the black pack and the rail systems. Check out all the Yak Attack's kite fishing products. They're amazing. The Fish Grip. Peanut butter and jelly with the kayak. Y'all heard me say it before. You can't kayak fish without a fish grip. And last but not least, hook one kayakfishinggear.com. It's where I get all my all pro rods, my Shimano reels, and just about everything I use. Catch y'all next time. A one, a two, a 